Hey guys, what's up? So I just got an email notification that a new package came in the mail. And it's Square Bar Organics. Um, they just had some new products released and it is protein popcorn and a new line of protein bars. So they sent me some for me to try and for me to let you know how they taste. That was a rough intro. Anyway, let's get to it. Suck at this. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay, you guys, so this is what it came to. Um, looks like we got, we got some sea salt flavored protein popcorn. Um, some spicy mild popcorn and some lightly sweet popcorn. And then as far as the bars go, I'm gonna have to dig a little bit and find them. But we got chocolate sea salt crisp bars. Here's the part where I tell you guys how much I suck and said so that I ate like almost all of that before I could really give a review. Go me, also I'm home now so like I have a couple popcorn bags left but they're back in Bloomington. So anyway, review, definitely my favorite of the popcorn would be the spicy mild, followed by the sea salt and then the lightly sweet. But I liked literally all of them and I will eat literally all of them. The portion size was huge. I believe it was like 15 fat, 20-ish carb, and 10 protein for the entire bag. And the bag was thick. T-H-I-C-C, thick. Other than that, they had these bars too and they were really cool because I don't know, they're more like an earthy kind of flavored bar and um, I probably like their other type of bars better, the ones that are already in stores, but these were good and I really liked, my favorite out of those was the coconut. They like a chocolate one, a coconut, and like an almond cashew kind of one, I think. Uh, like a, a vanilla cashew one. And the coconut was by far my favorite. So I definitely liked those too. Those are around like 190 calories, I think, 200 calories. And, um, I will probably definitely be buying those or at least the popcorn once they are in stores but that's my tidbit i'm sorry for being a sucky reviewer i'm sorry for loving all the foods before i can get to this review please don't hate me and today i want to talk to you about quote unquote surviving the holidays but i don't like the word surviving because i feel like it sounds like i don't know like you have to get through it and it's like a pain and in reality, holidays should be something that you look forward to, that you enjoy. You get to see your family, friends, people you might not see all year or four years. And I think um, like the health industry has kind of messed that up a little bit when they talk about it. So uh, I wanted to give you my best tips on kind of like dealing with the holidays, I guess you could say. And like going about the holidays, especially since Thanksgiving is tomorrow. So if you are on competition prep, first of all, first off... If you're on competition prep, you gotta stick to your plan. That's just the way it is. I'm sorry, um, unless your coach has said you can have that day off. But um, if you're not on competition prep, it's literally one day of the week, like of the year, I mean. And think about it, you probably have had cheat meals before with friends and family before in the past, and it's like, what's the difference about like just doing one on a holiday? So I really feel like it's all about moderation, and you shouldn't limit yourself from eating with your family just because it's not fitness. That being said, you probably shouldn't go balls to the wall with what you eat. So at least what I'm going to do is make sure for the first half of the day, because my family eats a Thanksgiving dinner kind of in the evening, like later afternoon, I'm going to be eating kind of maybe the lower calorie foods, more greens, more micronutrient based foods to fill me up and to make sure I'm getting like the nutrients I need for the day in during that time period and then I can have more fun when the actual meal comes when I'm with my family. So it's all about balance and it's not a whole day just to say F it, screw it. Like you really should try to find that balance. So anyway, that's my tidbit on Thanksgiving. When you look back on the holiday, I don't you, you probably don't want to think, oh, I limited myself. Like you want to remember the memories you have with your family. You don't want to feel awkward at the dinner table unless of course you're on competition prep. Anyway, that's just my tidbit. Do what you gotta do, do what you wanna do, have fun, eat some good food, that's it. <laughs>
Also, I just wanted to say, um, I did get my eyebrows microbladed yesterday, and today's day two, so right now they're looking kind of like darker, and they will not look this dark when they're done healing. So if you guys are like, oh, like what's going on? Like it looks like you have different eyebrows. That's what's up with that.